Hello YouTube and welcome to another video. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can make Slap House Bass using Ableton's stock plugin called the Operator and the bass sounds like this. So let's begin by going here and right clicking and opening a new MIDI track. In this MIDI track, we'll add the Operator We'll just drag and drop this MIDI clip down and uh, let's start adjusting everything in Operator. First we'll go to the global section of Operator and then we'll select this tone thing and we'll set it to 36 and the voices we'll set it to 1. That's it. That's what we're going to do in the global section. Then we're going to move to the oscillator 1 and then we're going to select saw wave in the oscillator 1 and we'll set the release to 50. Next we'll go to oscillator B, we're going to push it all the way up, sustain all the way up and release to 50. We're going to leave it at sine, the oscillator 2, we're going to leave it at sine wave. Only we're going to adjust is the phase which we're going to adjust at 21%. Then let's move to the oscillator C, we're going to go to the envelope and we're going to select copy from B and here we're going to select saw wave. The phase we're going to select is 51% and level we'll select 26. Sorry, 26. Yes. And now let's hear the sound. Let me solo it. Okay, this is not what a slap house bass is supposed to sound like. So let's shape the sound more with the filter. Let's go to the filter section, move the resonance all the way down. Filter frequency, we'll move to 107. Decay, we'll move to 1.93. Sustain, 31%. And envelope, we're gonna move to 91%. Now let's hear this. Okay, let's make this a little louder. Let's, from 18, minus 18 dB, let's push it to at least minus 10. Yeah, that's most of the work that we're going to do inside the operator. Now let's design it with the FX. First FX we're going to add is the saturator. We're going to add the saturator. We're going to turn the bass all the way down to minus 36 dB. And then over here, we're going to go and select medium curve. After that, we're going to go and select OTT. Drop that over here after the saturator and the amount we're going to set to around 40 and the output level we're going to keep it to around 6 db just let's hear how the sound is sounding right now very good now let's do some side chaining let's add my favorite side chaining device called the duck and let's set it to 81 percent And last but not the least, let's go and add a limiter just to control the peaks. Now let's hear the sound with the beat. So that's about it. That's it for this video. Please do click that like button and I'll see you in the next one.